I'm joined by Karina Hardgrave from the Irish Independent, who is a, a, the resident blind journalist. So we've got two very nice capitals here, both from the Penedès region, just south of Barcelona. We have a producer called Locherelle and their wine is Amaltea, that's the one with the lovely goat on the bottle. Goat's my favourite animal. Is it? Yeah. Well, goats and things. Um, and we have Reventos, which is from the oldest winemaking family in the world, I think. Late 1400s, they have owned um, plots of land in that region. Yeah. So the longest lineage. Wow. Yeah. That's yeah. nice. I like so that. you've been to Cava? I have, I have. And in fact, I was at uh, Cotonou, which is across the road from Reventos. Yeah. So, and it's quite interesting because Reventos are actually the people, that's the family that started Cotonou, the one that everyone knows. It's huge, it's big. And they just wanted to do something different. So they were looking at quality. So it was in, I think it was mid 80s, they broke away. Oh, well, yes. they sold out to Cotonou. Yeah. And um, they took all the best plots. So, because um, they knew from all of yeah. the long, long time. Oh, yeah. Life. And um, and then after that, in 2013, what they did was they bro broke away from the main Cava DO, which is the organisation yeah. that governs Cava, because they wanted to focus on a really, really quality Cava. And that's what you're getting here. Yeah. So, and you know when you taste it that there's yeah. something different about this. Great, great, great. And Amaltia, uh, that's predominantly Chirello grape. So yeah, what's, I what's think the Chirello grape. Right, so in the way in Champagne you can use a blend of grapes. Like, so, so Prosecco is one grape, it's, it's Lera. Yeah. In, in uh, Cava you can use quite a few grapes. So you can also use grapes that are ones we know like Chardonnay and Pinot Noir. Oh, yeah. But the ones which are called indigenous, which means they're from the area. There's Chirello, yeah. um, there's Parigada, okay. and then there's Machiavelli. Okay, great. So, and not, not grapes really that are very familiar to any of yeah. us. And they blend them. So, and these, both of these have quite a bit of Chirello. And Chirello is one of those quite trendy grapes now. They're yeah. making wine in 100% Chirello. So it's always interesting when you see quite a high percentage of Chirello in, in one right. of those colors. So should we have a little taste? Yes. A bit of a comparison. The... Um, the Amaltea one smells quite light, doesn't it? It does, but it's really floral as yeah, well. Yeah, isn't it? And mm. pears or something very yeah. like um, but crisp. Mm. It's just really floral. You know, it's fragrant and floral and kind of a bit girly. Yeah. Yeah. In a nice way, a delicate way. Yeah, indeed. And then the Reventos. Mm. And it is delicate when you drink it, but very fresh. Really fresh. Mm. And kind of creamy, mm. but that's organic as well. Yeah, they're so yeah. I think they're both organic actually. Yeah, they um, are. Yeah, both, both organic. In fact, I think these might even be biodynamic, which oh, is they are. This one's definitely biodynamic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. which is like organic with a hell of a bit more. Yeah, of yeah, really pure. Like what I love about biodynamic wines is that because you can't use any chemicals, you have to be in the vineyard. You have to look at the, yeah. the vines yeah. all the time, and it's just extra love, extra labour. Just, you know, if you have a garden and you're out, if you look at the plant every day, you know if it's healthy or not. Yeah. But if you yeah. don't look at it for like a month or so and kill plants like I do. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but it's amazing, like the difference, the love and attention. You yeah. really taste the quality in grapes, you know? I know. Yeah. Anytime, like, I look out for, and I think a lot of people are looking out for organic wine now. Yeah. Because, you know, they're, you know, watching it in their food and now they're yeah. looking out for it in wine. Yeah. But biodynamic means it's just one step. Yeah. And if you eat biodynamic, it's always going to be good for Yeah. You. It's well, it's just going to be high quality. Yeah. You tend to get a lot of intensity as well, don't you? Mm. You do. Yeah. You do. Yeah. yeah. So the Reventos is, um, for me, it smells like classically what Cava is. And more. And more. I Tell think. me. Tell me. So Cava, this is the interesting thing as well with Cava, because Cava is aged, whereas Prosecco doesn't get any age. Cava is aged yeah. for a minimum of nine months. So you have nine months aging on this. But this one, Reventos, because they broke away, well, I think both of these mm. guys have broken away, um, they age it for 18 months. So right. that's why you're getting slightly dark yeah, colour. Yeah, it is a dark colour. Yeah. I don't know if you can see that. And this is light, this is more golden, this yeah. is more yeah. uh, lemony. Yeah. And yeah. you're getting more in the nose. And I think as well, some of that earthiness you're getting is that Chirello, because yeah. Chirello is got, sometimes you get kind of a fennel note in uh, Cava. Yeah, yeah so. and that's Chirello. So Chirello yeah. is kind of the fel fennel one. Yeah. And the Machiavelli is fruity, and the Pariata is uh, This has been very eye-opening. Thank you very much, my Cava lesson. And that's just beautiful. Yeah. It's, if you like sparkling wine, if you like champagne, if you like that richer yeah. style, earthier style, there's a lot of finesse to that, isn't there? there Depth, is. complexity, loads mm. of flavour. And I think that's a good point because I think you're really looking at 
chanting yeah. when you're drinking a kava like yeah. this. There's, you know, there's that real depth, that beautiful absolutely. richness in it. Absolutely, absolutely. It's and beautiful. you've got this lovely, actually, um, kind of fleshy fruit finish. Yeah. Pears and melons. And yeah. Things. So it's, although it's, it's, it's um, savoury, star fruity finish for me. Yeah, I yeah. agree. And like layers. Yeah. You know, you layers. just get some layers. Great. It's beautiful. Yeah, so this is a kava, reventos and a multi-end.